I, like, is this real? Literally the Not My Job Award. If I drove past that sign, I think you could hear my eyes rolling all the way over here. Today we'll be showing you a few funny quotes that have shown up on fast food signs. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, I love that idea. That's hilarious. That sounds intriguing. I'm trying to think of funny fast food quotes. You mean like somebody swapped out the letters and wrote something funny? So like my favorite video ever is the free shavakadoos. And I know that came from like a fast food sign. I go to a lot of fast food restaurants, so maybe I've seen somebody <laughs> try, <laughs> try our new crap. <laughs> McDonald's. I wonder if they got like you know, corporate punishment for this? I hope not, because it's kind of funny. That's pretty accurate. Sorry, Mickey D's. I love it, yeah. You know what, they're being honest. It's just, try our new crap. You know, they have some really nice, new, state-of-the-art crap. I feel like McDonald's is definitely a, a brand that like prides itself on saying that their food isn't total crap. So, I mean, th this is a multi-layered joke. Try our new crap. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, I always think it's funny, like, when I, you know, I go to McDonald's a lot, and there's, like, those healthy options, and it's just, like, you know, the joke still remains. Like, who goes to McDonald's and get a salad? Like, who goes to McDonald's and gets a kale egg white breakfast bowl? Like, you're there to get your pancake combo. Let's be real. Subway hiring, but not rehiring. Damn. It's very ominous. Like, what's wrong with that subway? Like, what did, like, Jeffrey Dahmer work there? I guess people kept going back after they got fired. Would you really be trying to get your job back at Subway? Like, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe Subway is a really great place to work, and I've just never experienced it. I don't know why you would call back and beg for your job back at Subway. I feel like there's, right? I feel like that's, like, the bottom of the barrel. I wish it said, like, Craig, you know, or something. Like, we're not gonna hire you back, Ryan. Wendy's, we do got fish. Straight to the point. That's good, it's just silly. This is very reassuring because I was really concerned that particular Wendy's did not have fish. What? <laughs> I mean, they're very straight to the point. Advertisements can be so off the wall sometimes, but if that's on purpose and that's just to catch attention, it works. I didn't have the question of whether they had fish or not, but I guess it's a good fish to know. I mean, fish to know, good fact to know. Burger King. Try the cheesy anus burger. Ah, uh, it doesn't sound pleasing at all. Now that sounds delightful. It actually sounds kind of shitty, doesn't it? I don't want to think about anus when I'm, you know, thinking of eating a cheeseburger. Honestly, that picture just sums up Burger King as a whole for me. Cheesy anus burger. Because <laughs> it's Angus. It's Angus steak. You just take the G out and it's anus. It's brilliant. Let us meet all of your expectations. That's my favorite just because it's like, Pun on pun on wordplay, it's just amazing. <sighs> That's so bad that it's good. This one's nice, because it's funny and it's witty. I like it. They got a punny staff. That's a good one, you guys. I think that's cute. I would eat there. This is cute. This is like a family-friendly funny one. Like, oh, <laughs> like you're just driving to Sunday church and look at what they did on the subway sign. <laughs> My goodness. Whoever wrote that should actually be fired and they cannot be rehired. If I drove past that sign, I think you could hear my eyes rolling all the way over here, like no matter where that was. Try our pickup window. Try our next, try our new fox fillet. I mean, <laughs> I met fish. I don't know why that's so funny. It just sounds like a really bad match.com thing or something. That guy had to be really bored at work. I don't get it, why not just, I mean, clearly you have letters for fish. So it's like, if you meant fish, you would have just put fish. Now I'm confused. Is it fish? Is it fox? I don't know. Sometimes when you eat somewhere, do you ever feel like you're not really sure what the meat is? Like it could actually be fox. I love that one. That one's actually like really funny. Just the guy is just like the, literally the not my job award. Oh, another McDonald's one. Our team is well endowed to guarantee your pleasure. Ew. McDonald's, man. I'm gonna choose McDonald's from now on. I had no idea. And this is a game changer, really. Did they check? Did, did be, is it part of the interview process? Do you walk in and they're like, okay, so uh, Steve, I'm gonna need you to uh, to stand up and drop your pants. I know what people are suggesting. They're trying to make it, or maybe I'm the dirty one. I don't know. I, I think people like want to make this a sexual thing. I just see it as like a, you know, they're, they're qualified to make a good burger. This isn't even like so much like somebody having fun as like somebody just, I, like, is this real? Someone had to get fired over that one. Wendy's. Wendy's. 
In memory of Dave, we will miss you. Now hiring. <laughs> Poor Dave. It's so creepy. Poor Dave. Poor Dave worked at Wendy's his whole life and now he's just being replaced. I bet you all those people from Subway are gonna go over there and try to get that job. They're being honest. They're like, yeah, he's a cool guy, but you know, do we need someone to run the cash register now? <laughs> You're like, wow, you guys just really, really just turn around that quickly. Like I die on Tuesday, on Thursday, there's already a sign like looking for my replacement. And it's Wendy as it has to go on. Now it brings the question like, what happened to Dave? Because you're putting it on your sign. It was it was it because of Wendy's Dairy Queen. Scream until Daddy stops the car. Mhm. Mm That's what you gotta do to get it, to get what you want. Scream until Daddy stops the car. This is it. This is my favorite one by far. Like, there's no other way. Honestly, that's just the best one. Actually, genius advertising. As a marketing person, I'm very impressed. I wonder if that worked. <laughs> like, actually, got some people like. Well, thanks for that sign. Still pretty slow there, Daddy Dairy Queen. But then again, I mean, that's not necessary. I mean, I can be a 20 year old and my mom's driving and I could scream and, until she stops the car. Dairy Queen, you're messing up. You're gonna bring in the wrong crowd. You're gonna bring in like those really weird guys slash girls. It doesn't really matter. And just like the ones who, if you call someone daddy, just stop. That's it, there's a PSA now. You're stoned, it's 3 a.m., nothing else is open. Next right, Denny's. That is just brutally honest. That is so true. I can't count the times I have gone to Denny's and like everyone just looks like stoned or drunk out of their mind. There are 24 hour like McDonald's joints and stuff, but Denny's you can like go in and sit, so it's kind of better. That one wins at Denny's. You can tell they're independently owned, I'm gonna guess, because I feel like corporate would never endorse that message. You know how you are when you're doing something and it's late at night and you, you're at a party or whatever and you're just so freaking hungry and you just want any food and usually it ends up being somewhere like Denny's or a fast food restaurant. So this is like a legitimate piece of advertising. That is beautiful. It's true, it could not be more true. It's just like, this is what we are. We all know why you're coming here, so it's on the next right, like just come. People are really having a good time with those signs. I wish I had them around me because I would like to look at them and like make fun of them. I love when people have senses of humor, especially in a fast food context, because you have to laugh at fast food. You gotta get a little something out of it besides like eight zillion calories and like food made out of Anus? I don't know. Angus? Thanks for watching this episode on the React channel. Don't forget to subscribe. We have new shows every day. Hit that like button if you like this episode. Bye, guys. Hey, guys, I'm Katie, a React channel producer. Let me know if you've seen any funny fast food signs down in the comments. Thanks, guys. Bye.